We had a small track about uh, Aqua and IPFS, and as uh, Aqua is a new concept for the IPFS community, mainly we were studying what it is, making it more familiar, and uh, uh, brainstorming uh, how it could help IPFS, uh, how we could integrate, and so on. So uh, we had talk about Aqua, we had a workshop to show the developer experience because everything works, and uh, we had talk about Aqua VM uh, to understand the fundamentals uh, and why, why it's designed this way and so on. So main, main learnings. Uh, first of all, Aqua works. <laughs> That's nice, uh, we can show it. Uh, and uh, uh, it allows to write distributed Aquas once uh, and reuse them across implementations in different languages and so on. So uh, this algos become very portable. And uh, uh, what was uh, kind of new for us is that uh, the node design uh, that Aqua enables um, is uh, of value on its own because it's very slim and uh, lightweight uh, and uh, all the behaviors uh, could be added with Aqua and uh, WebAssembly. Uh, which is kind of nice. Um, we understand now that uh, adding IPLD is super important uh, for uh, inputs, outputs, and it fits perfectly to Aqua. So it's uh, on the action items now, uh, number one, uh, to enable minimization, cache, stop regime, and so on. Uh, and uh, uh, with uh, the topologies that uh, limits uh, the number of peers involved, uh, we can solve uh, or provide some of the solutions for IPFS transport challenges uh, by re-implementing Cademlia or uh, uh, making hierarchical Cademlia and heterogeneous network uh, with help of Aqua. But action items, IPLD in Aqua VM is a must have and uh, on the list like a nearest milestone. We want to create a public roadmap for AquaVM to become more transparent for the community. Uh, would be awesome to try implementing IPFS or maybe uh, Filecoin as well uh, with Aqua and WebAssembly. We want to have more uh, ready to use received algos to start and play with it so that uh, you try not the language but the solution uh, and then uh, start from that. Uh, we want to like as uh, Aqua is language for, like exactly for this community, uh, for peer-to-peer -peer networks, uh, it could be beneficial to lift uh, some of uh, very special needs, uh, which we usually uh, use like low-level code uh, to, to express, to lift them to Aqua. Uh, for example, capabilities model and you can, uh, we will research this field and also, we want to research and integrate possibly zero knowledge, uh, and uh, in particular, we are interested in LURK uh, and integration it with uh, Aqua. Milestones, soon, public roadmap. A bit later, IPLD with Aqua VM, but by the end of this year, I think we should have it. And uh, beginning of the next year, uh, bit swap in Aqua. That's all.